What's good guys, I'm Mike Marina. We are out here at Elite FTS. We are gonna do some quick warm-ups for the bench press. I myself have been through multiple pec tears. I'm still out here benching. Roll with me. So exercise number one, all you need is a mini band. It could be red, orange, doesn't really matter. I have the Elite FTS one. You guys can get them on their website. So basically what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this we're going to wrap it around our shoulders. We're going to put it in our hands right here. We're going to drop down. Oh, shit. And what we are going to do is we're going to plant our hands in. And what we are going to try to focus on is pulling our subscap forward, driving back. Forward, driving back. Trying to keep the arms straight. Don't bend the arms. All we're trying to do is pull the chest through the shoulders. Reach as high as back as we can. Hold. You want to do these for about 10. Hold. Control your breathing. Back down. And what this is going to do is going to help our stabilizers in the back, the rotator cuff. Um, to help stabilize when you get under the bar and help protect some of those pec muscles. Try it out. All right, guys, we are at it with warm up number two. This is what I do personally for pre bench. So basically, you're going to take like a foam roller, anything that you can put in between your legs right here. Now, what we're going to do, uh, we're going to take the same band, put it behind us. And basically, we're gonna do what we just did over there on the floor against the wall. And we are going to take pressure into the pad with our legs and you're going to push, keep constant tension. And now what we're doing is we're going to push our shoulders back and reach. Same thing we're doing on the floor, this time we're doing it into the wall. And you're going to hold for about three seconds, then you're going to big air, Push, push further, 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 further for three more seconds. And you're going to do one more round. Let your air out. Push one, two, three. Ooh. So that is what we're trying to do is stretch out the lat and lengthen the muscle to where we're not tearing anything when we're benching. Try it out. All right, here we are. Third and final uh, warm up. There's so many more warm-ups we can do, but we wanna to try to keep them to three to maybe five exercises. If you overdo it, then you're just gonna get a little fatigued. So come on. Basically, what we're gonna do is grab a two board, which is what I have behind me. It could be a foam roller, anything that has roughly about this much space. And what we're going to do is, we're gonna sit up tall. We're gonna take our hand. We're gonna put it behind us to the side. And we're gonna go three sides, we're gonna go low, and basically what we're trying to do is we're gonna to touch the pad, we're going to reach behind us. One, we're gonna go 10 rounds, up to 10, then we're gonna go middle, same. If you can't touch it, it's okay. Then we're gonna go high, which is really hard. Same thing. Then you will repeat on the other side. What this is gonna do, is work the muscles around the rotator cuff. Can I build those stabilities, get them nice and moving better? Again, so when we're pressing. A lot of the times you guys think that when we bench press, we wanna get the pecs opened or tight or loose. We don't necessarily wanna do that. It's yes and no, we're gonna get them slightly stretched, but we wanna focus more on what's behind us and that's in the back, your shoulders, your lats, and your rotator cuffs. Try them out guys, I'm out. If you like this clip and you wanna see another, click here. If you wanna see the whole podcast, click here.